there guys, MSMV1 here, and welcome to the Escapists! I thought I'd play this game for a little bit, because it's, um, it's actually kind of a popular game right now, all thanks to Jacksepticeye. Um, I'm just gonna go right ahead and, uh, actually how, how about we use MSMV1. Um, just so I remember that this save file is indeed a YouTube save file. Um, I have gotten to the Shankton State Pen prison. Uh, I have yet to unlock these ones. Um, I haven't actually tried this one yet. Uh, but we're just gonna go ahead and do the first one. And if things go well, I might do the, this one. And then I'll try to escape this one. Then we'll do this one if I manage to escape this one. I don't think I'll be able to do this one though. Uh, People say it is extremely hard. Anyway, how about we don't need to go through a tutorial, right? All right, let's just go to Center Perks. Uh, it's very easy. Um, I actually do not know how I escaped this prison. It's been a long time. We're just gonna keep the officers the way they are, um, and all the other inmates and stuff. Um, Dear MSMV1, welcome to Center Perks, the most comfortable, low-security prison in the county. On behalf of all the staff here, we wish you a happy and relaxing visit. Should you get bored of the complimentary cable TV, we pride ourselves in many other engaging activities around the grounds. Warden Sparrow. So yeah, basically, this is a brilliant... We don't really need to go through that. Uh, so basically, this game is all about routines. So basically in this prison the first thing we go through is morning roll call. Um, there's evening meals, there's breakfast, there's uh, shower periods, there's free time, um, all sorts of different period time periods uh, that normal prisons would have. Um, so as the ta uh, as the name of the game suggests, this is a game revolved around escaping prisons, um, and Shankton State Pen is actually kind of a hard one to escape, in my opinion. Um, all right, I I don't remember this pri prison whatsoever. I, I I still have yet to get used to it. I am not that great at the game. I'll I'll say it right now. Let's just take a food tray and sit down. Really? No one wants. I'm just gonna sit down next with my friend Lee. Um, so there, there's a lot to go through in this game. There's a lot of crafting involved. You can, you could do many really interesting things. Like you can dig underground and escape that way. Um, there, there are different colored keys which you can use to open. See, here we have free period going on. So this is basically what. Where, where we could do whatever the hell we want. Um, I Right now our strength is 30, speed is 30, and intellect is 30. I don't really concentrate on speed because, well, speed is, is it determines how quickly you can attack s someone. Because you there is combat. If I press space, this arrow turn. Whoa! That's good! All right. See, there, there's a ton of different items you could get, uh, such as a, I've got a cup and lighter here. Um, well, that's actually really good because there's something you can make called a cup of molten chocolate, I think it's called. Dirty and made on a hand fan for sure. Um, and that's basically an instant knockout, um, which is actually really good because I, I, th I I'm, I'm starting to remember now, um, the way I did in more cups? This is good. This is a really good start, I must say. Um, I I got keys from uh, from from the not wardens, the guards, uh, of, uh, and and I used them to open up certain doors, and that's how I escaped. Um, there are snipers in this game who will. Basically, if you try to escape right now in the outdoors, they will basically shoot you with their stun guns or something. Uh, sleep darts or whatever. Pedicure kit? I don't really need that. Um, if the if the if if the gods notice me in any one of these uh uh these 
battery, we can make an improved sock mace. Um, they will get angry if they if they see us in any other cell other than our own cell. Uh, nails. Yeah, that's actually good. Um, if I could get a, a log. Well, not a log, a uh, timber. That would actually be really good, because then I can make a, a good, uh, oh, now it's lunch. Uh, I can make a good weapon. A good starter weapon. Uh, an improved sock mace is alright, I guess, but, uh, I, I'd rather stick with the, I forgot what it's called, I think it's called the spike bat. I don't know. You can make a regular bat, and then you, you, you use nails, and you get a spike bat. Oh, God, someone's fighting. Alright. Uh, you can also take, um, favors. Oops, I did not mean to push him out of his seat. Officer Hans, no. Um, basically, they'll ask for a bunch of different favors. Uh, the people that have this golden sack um, over them, uh, they that means that they're selling things. And this guy's actually selling some pretty good stuff. Uh, I do want this tub of talcum powder. Because if you combine a tub of talcum powder and toothpaste together, you can get a wad of putty. And that's what I actually use. Hey, Heiko, I'm going to say Laundry job! Oh yeah, there are also jobs in this game. Um, if you do not meet your job quota, which you will see in the bottom right hand corner, uh, you will get fired, and uh, none of these are contraband. Good. Uh, the things in red are contraband. Um, th this here is a contraband detector, which I just went through. That's a door, and this is a contraband detector. If I am actually uh, holding contraband, that will take my... Actually, if you if you look on the top left hand corner, you have fatigue, heat, health, and cash. Cash and heat, uh, no, sorry, cash and health are well self-explanatory. Heat means how oh, like how alert the police are uh, to you. Um, if your heat is 90 or above, they will attack you on sight. But if they're anything below 90, they won't really attack you. Uh, and basically, if I take something that's red here, like a dirty guard outfit, through the contraband detector, my heat will go all the way up to 99%, and that's obviously not what we want to do. Um, but right now, we're just uh, stuffing some dirty laundry into the the the, the 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 washing machines here. So it's a very easy job, and to be honest, it's a good pay. Uh, in the other prisons, you start off with quite bad jobs, which have really bad pay, so it's not great. Um, I think we're about to meet our job quota, but I need to make sure that I drop these guard outfits here so I do not go through the contraband detector. Because also, um, these outdoor bits, uh, if your heat is 90 or above, uh, the snipers are are ordered to shoot you on sight. Now these things are prisoner stashes um, in these utility places. There's so many things. However, we need a we need an orange key as it seems and each officer here or guard I like to call him has a different color key I think there's a green yellow orange red and purple key um, each officer has a different color key and each color key opens a magic color door uh, I'll show you guys uh, oh whoops uh, that's right um, this is exercise period. Basically, you you have the chance to uh, work out, work out, and uh, increase your strength and speed stats. Uh, what I was doing before was uh, I was browsing the internet, which brings up your intellect. Um, I will be mostly concentrating on strength and intellect. Um, now it's shower block. Uh, yeah. As you um, browse the internet and uh, uh, work out with the weights or the booster pads or whatever they're called, um, th your fatigue goes up, and if that's up to 100%, you can't do anything else. Um, right now, what I want to do is make a weapon, because what I'm going to try and do... Uh, well, first of all, I need to get... Oh, right, I have 50 cash. Someone was uh, selling... Uh, I, can't, I can't quite afford a baton. If you press shift and hover over something, it uh, it shows what how good it is. And this has a weapon of three out of five, so it's a pretty good weapon. But we're not really gonna we're gonna we're gonna make a uh, here we go here we go timber and a roll of duct tape. Um, those are really good tools actually. Um, 
So with the timber, we can make a thingamajog and a, a bat. And we can do something with a roll of duct tape. Um, I think with a sheet of metal, we can make a plated inmate uh, outfit, which basically adds a three defense, which is really good. Uh, we're probably gonna want to do that. Uh, however, I'm gonna look through my journal because you have these crafting. You'll see. This is what we're gonna try and do. Uh, we're gonna try and make a wad of pu uh, putty, which will require talcum powder and toothpaste. And then basically, you can make these uh, blah 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 key molds. Well, basically, you need the key and the wad of putty, and then we'll make the the key mold. Uh, and this is the basically the one hit KO. Uh, item, the cup of molten chocolate. Um, we're gonna mostly be making those t to um, get the keys off the officers. See, you can get the keys off the guards. However, this is what we want to make a wooden bat. Uh, however, they will notice that their key is missing and then they'll send you to something called solitary confinement. Uh, or I'll just say solitary for short. Uh, see, there's more staff key mold, utility key mo mold. Uh, here we go. S oh, dude, we need uh, a lot of timber and a lot of duct tape for that. Uh, we're also going to try and make uh, cutters to cut through wire. If I remember, I had to cut through wire. You can also make lightweight or sturdy cutters. Sturdy cutters uh, don't decay as, as quick. Um... No, not the plate of POW. Uh, see, here's a here's a plastic staff key. This is how you make your own plastic keys. You need, uh, I think we saw it somewhere, um, molten plastic, which you just need to have a, a comb or a toothbrush and a lighter. Uh, you you put those in the crafting tab here, and then you make and then you'll make a uh, molten plastic. Hang on, I'm gonna. I'm gonna show you how crafting works. So we're gonna put timber and roll duct tape. I need six more intelligence. Yeah, intelligence is quite important. However, I'm just gonna slip myself out and be a bit sneaky. Um, actually, I'm gonna see what this guy has. He has a pillow as a weapon. All right. Um, I'm gonna just uh, browse the. Uh oh. Yeah. See if 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 the uh, if the officers notice that you're not where you have to be. Um, they will they will shout at you. See, they they keep shouting at me. Uh, evening free time. Now we can um, have fun, do whatever we want. Um, this is a very forgiving prison, to be honest. Cable TVs. I don't think I don't think an actual prison would have that. All right, time to make ourselves a wooden bat. Now all I need is more duct tape and more timber, and then I will be able to make myself. I think the wooden bat is already three out of five weapons, so it's actually a pretty good weapon in the beginning already. Now, if only we could find chocolate, that then we can make a cup of molten chocolate, which is really good in the start. I'm actually gonna take a tube of toothpaste, and then if we find a, ta t a tub of uh, talcum powder, we can make a water putty. And uh, water, pu I'm gonna eat the cookie. Cookie, yummy. Um, and then we can already get a mold of some keys, which is uh, really good. Oh, okay. This this game is really good. Um, I, I just want to point that out there because I don't think there's anything else I need to explain at the moment. I could chip through this wall to have myself a secret contraband stash. I could do that honestly, but not not really right now. Um, but this game. It's really well made, uh, even though it is not brilliant graphics-wise. And honestly, I, I I think the graphics are fine already in the game. Um, the concept is really good. Um, it's really fun. I I really like strategy games, so this might be a bit biased because I really love strategy games like this, uh, where you can plan out what you want to do. Um, the t my my two favorite games, uh, game genres, is financial games and strategy games. I mean, FPSs are also pretty cool, but I'm not a big fan of them. There's only one exception where I really love FPS, and that's uh, Fallout New Vegas. I absolutely adore that game. What are you selling? Uh, foil? Sheet of metal. See, I can't afford anything, so that's a bummer. Uh, let, let's, let's work up on our strength for a bit here. Because uh, it's 
It's, it's soon gonna be lights out. Lights out is when we go to sleep. I'm pretty sure you guys know that. Um, by the way, there are also gonna be these uh, periodic um, yeah, evening roll call. Uh, basically, we get these periodic cell shakedowns where they send in officers to check the uh, the cells. So if you're keeping any contraband in your desk, you will be sent to solitary. Um, which is not good. Also, CC uh, shakedowns, cell shakedowns. Right now it's Spot and Terrell. It is not me. Um, actually, is Terrell is. Oh wait, I already checked what Terrell's selling. Let's see what favors we have. I'm gonna look out for a sponge. Sure, I can find you a sponge, Officer Ross. No, I do not want to beat up any officers right now. Anyways, um, any other favors? Yes, Benjamin. I need Terrell laid out on the floor. I do it myself, but the guards have me in the scopes. Absolutely, I have a wooden bat. Although I'm gonna train up my uh, strength a bit so I can take more hit hits. Now it's lights out where they basically lock your door. And yeah, and then you're supposed to sleep. This is the moment where I could use my time and chip out a wall, chip chip through the wall, but I don't really have anything to chip through the wall with, so, um, so far we have no contraband stashed in our place, uh, so, I'm gonna leave it here, guys, uh, as I said, this game is really fun, I'm probably gonna be, uh, doing more of it, uh, but I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna make it a full-on series, because I'm pretty sure many other people have already done it out there, um, I suggest Jacksepticeye, um, but if you guys enjoyed, please hit that like button, and it would really help out if you could subscribe as well. Um, I will see you all in the next episode of The Escapists. Um, I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye!